Hi again everyone. Have you seen all those wonderful Christmas lights turning up around in your neighbours houses and around the community? I have and that doesn't include the ones on me and around this room. I wonder if you've asked the question when did this Christmas light thing start up? Well it was quite a long time ago and there's a wonderful clue to the answer to that question at the top of the Eiffel Tower. My family and I went to the Eiffel Tower just over two years ago and when we reached the top we discovered some wonderful uh, waxwork models of a famous inventor called Thomas Edison and also the creator of the Eiffel Tower Gustave Eiffel and you will know the famous inventor uh, Edison he is remembered for being the first to successfully invent a practical light bulb a bit different from this one but not too dissimilar and he also had a very close friend by the name of uh, Edward Johnson who was also a partner in his company the uh, Edison Illumination Company and they worked together in 1882 to put together the first Christmas lights which were 80 red, blue and white lights that they wrapped around their Christmas tree. Not only that, the Christmas tree revolved. <laughs> Fancy that. Wow. Now, you can see I've got a whole mixture of Christmas lights on me. Colourful ones and some white ones with lots of different, different settings from flashing quickly, slowly, not flashing at all. Eight different settings. Pretty cool, eh? And have you noticed on the top of my head, I've got some very beautiful coloured lights to form a crown. That reminds me that sometimes we can get a bit carried away with our lights and what we do with them. And we can sometimes become a bit too boastful and proud, like saying things like, I've got better lights than anyone else. Look at my show, my display. It's the greatest. Well, for me as a Christian, Christmas always reminds me that there is a most wonderful and spectacular display of light that is far greater than the switching on of the lights in our lo local communities. What am I going on about? Well, that awesome display of light that can never be put out or switched off was when Jesus Christ, the light of the world, came into our dark world to bring light into our darkness. Here is a great description in the Bible about how Jesus has done this and he continues to do it. For God, who said, let there be light in the darkness, has made this light shine in our hearts so we could know the glory of God that is seen in the face of Jesus Christ. So that, to me, is the greatest Christmas light switch on ever. Happy Christmas, everybody.